personally, I've always enjoyed the training part of running more than the racing. The racing is something that kind of gets me inspired, but uh, in the end, it's always being in the mountains, exploring that keeps bringing me back to running. I'm here in, in Montana in a mountain range that I've never been to with my friends and teammates from all over the world. Following the rut 50K, we wanted to check out the Beartooth Absaroka Wilderness. For something like this, you just really don't know what to expect. And the excitement comes from sharing a, an experience in, in the wilderness with my friends. Where to even start? Too much frickin' food. Food for 10 people for three days. We'll be running down this valley, down, down, down this valley to Wounded Up. Man Creek. Around. And then, uh, <laughs> so this is just a humongous, uh, very high plateau. What I enjoy the most during this trip, it's to be together. It's the group, the family's favorite. We all have our own reasons for doing what we're doing, but in the end we can come together with the same idea that we're gonna go out and have a great run together. It really brings you back to your roots. We're very communicated well today and my, my whole thing was like no decisions. Guys, have a sausage, I was like, sausage uh, appetizer out here. Oh, see you later. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh with mustard. Yeah, what did you get? Yeah. It's gonna be a huge day tomorrow. Yeah, we maybe more than 50k, huh? Yeah, mm -hmm. it's definitely gonna be more than 50k. Yeah, it's like 55k. I wish you got the coffee going. Oh, were you snoring last night? One of the goal is uh, to meet some <clears throat> animals like this. <laughs> this is my first time in the bear tooth. Vacation! Yeah. Ricky, I'm going to smash this. <laughs> the trails out here are absolutely amazing. It's just the running heaven. I had no idea of what the bear tooths were going to look like. We're going to come across bears. This is where we're going to come across them. Very important that we just stick together. This estate is known to be wild. And it's very incredible for us to discover. Oh, Tom! Don't ruin the shot, Tom. <laughs> no cheating. Come on, Tom. We are almost at the highest point of today. It's totally different than run a race to be competitive. It's more about enjoying just to see something else in nature, which is really good. The thing is, is that I got onto this mechanical bowl the other day, and I I got my full 10 seconds, but it came at a cost. I like that one. Getting out there, uh, you do forget about competition. All this goes away, and what lives is really the, the friendship and just the passion for running. This is where we meet. <laughs> this yeah. is where we all have you made up. <laughs> awesome. With these photos from today, uh, good, good memories. Um, stunning. One of the nicest trails I've ever been on. It's, it's magic. I don't want to go to school. <laughs> I finally got my coffee. Oh, the you. morning is much better. <laughs> yep. Any bears? Nope. Okay. Okay, cool. We'll leave the bear spray in the car then. <laughs> A running trip is interesting to explore new mountains, new landscapes, but uh, it's also interesting to be able to meet some local people. 
to learn with them. Hey, here you guys all just ran a rut. Yeah. You had pretty good weather for it this year, didn't you? Yeah, we got really lucky. You know, you can learn a lot about the people and about how that terrain shapes the people that live here. I think it's equally as important as exploring the wilderness. It appears though Team Solomon has a little bit of extra energy, so they're going to bag a peak. What peak is it? The pyramid. There you have it. Team Solomon. Solomontana Freedom Tour. These are chanterelles. These are my favorite mushroom in the whole world. <laughs> Can't pass these up. <laughs> this is the reason you're a trail runner. You can't see Montana in a lifetime, but you can certainly try and do it in a few days and absorb three days worth of beauty and camaraderie. There's all sorts of adventures to be had for anyone that has curiosity about exploring new places and spending time with quality people. It broadens your horizon so much.